for the impact of Taliban's control over women in, in the areas under their control is unfortunately very disproportionate. Um, for example, they have um, limited women's movement. Uh, they uh, they have not allowed them to go to work. And then the call I had three days ago, and then one of the stories I received today says that in Badakhshan province, where, um, where I come from, um, they burned the houses of um, religious minority uh, Shia Ismaili people. And then they uh, they said, you are kafir. The same thing, um, my neighbor, a 13 years old girl in Badakhshan in Daraim district, she was going out and then they, they beat her badly. So the community went to Taliban and was like, why you beat this, this girl? And they were like, she was uh, walking um, out alone. So they agreed that they won't beat women, but a woman should be um, uh, in a company of male when she is outside, no matter how, how young or how old she is. And then freedom of movement definitely, uh, when it's limited, means women cannot access health care if they need it. They cannot go to school, they cannot go to work. Um, and then this, the, the detrimental impact, unfortunately, I want to say again, is very disproportionate on women and very negatively affect um, their freedom and their access to their basic human rights across Afghanistan. Um, they are not changed. 